Hey everyone, just gonna give you a bit of an update. My uh, legacy videos didn't really turn out very well. Didn't like the UI of Skyrim and uh, the default UI. So I'm just gonna scrap that and uh, we'll start another playthrough on SC. Just lots of problems that went wrong, lots of crashing, lots of freezing. So we're starting a new normal playthrough. I'll be archery, what I do in my mainstream. Hope you guys enjoy yourself. Well, hey guys, uh, my game's busted. <laughs> the vanilla start does not work at all. It's completely messed up. Like my character wanders off into the distance during the part where you have to follow the captain. So we're just going to play with live another life. Thankfully I have this mod. So with this, we just have to go into Helgen, read in a notebook what's going on, and then go from there. Yeah, sir, I tried to do the vanilla start for you guys, but it's just busted. So that's not happening today, I guess. I don't know, could be customizable camera that's breaking it, but I'm not shutting that off for this. You know, just for the the intro that I've seen probably a hundred times, and you guys have probably seen like a hundred times. If you haven't seen it and you want to see it, uh, just go look it up on YouTube. Someone probably has it. Let's read the journal though, see what's going on. And that's that. Yeah, for a build for this character, I'm probably going to use the build that I that I usually use, like they use on stream. And I did a video last week about that. It's just basic um, half magicka, half thief. So like conjuration, a lot of summoning, a lot of archery, very little melee. But I like to put uh, a little bit of points into one handed just to even the odds a bit when I get uh, out of mana and stuff like that. I might even use some staves too. I'm Ever since my Breton, I've been kind of like in a magic -y mood. But I don't want to get ahead of myself. We'll start with archery and I'll go on from there. Yeah, I tried to play original Skyrim and it was good for about six episodes. And then the game just started to break like crazy and got really sick of the default UI, which is awful. Yeah, so we'll just reboot. It's all good. Uh, you know what? It's... I might go with Rayloth this time. I think we went with Hadvar last time. Well, you just have to do that. I'm going to take... Can you talk to him again? We have a potion for you. Give him that. There. And then he'll continue his scripted quest. So he should be acting normal now. Talos guide you. Mm -hmm. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out without your help today. Just a bit too bright. I'll adjust it as need be. Yeah, that's too bad, but you know, what can you do? Oh, so much more clean, too. Yeah, I want to take that. That's 
should be a book here. That's not a lore book, so I'll... Don't need to read that. Yeah, it's funny, I had like every single um, graphic fix for Old Rim. And it still uh, stuttered. And I had like zero mods on, like four. <laughs> it still ran like crap. That is unbelievable. It just, it's kind of crazy. It just blows you out of the water how much of uh, graphical uplift and system uplift uh, SE is in comparison, you know? However, there were some cool quiver mods that I found on for SE that I actually don't have on Special Edition that I want to check out. You know, just from playing uh, SE for, or Old Rim for a bit. Very curious. It was involved for nothing. That's funny, he like swung as he died. I don't need iron. I mean, you know what? Yeah, let's get some iron. Why not? I don't know, I kind of like this preset too. The uh, Lisa preset. All my presets I use are high poly now. Just thinking of a world where, you know, 10 years ago playing with barely any mods. If I were to show someone like, you know, gameplay footage of this back to like 2011, like I don't think people would believe me. You know, just like the animations, the UI, the look of the characters, the textures, like it's crazy. You know what? I'll take your hide armor. I should probably be wearing light armor. I'll probably wear some custom mod armor next time. For now, we'll play it vanilla-esque. I've actually had a lot of fun playing on stream too. We're actually almost done my playthrough. Kind of crazy. Thinking about that. Like that means meaning I've done like... Wild. I mean like the game never ends, right? You know, you can just keep doing raiding quests forever. Okay, let's uh, take out this guy first. Oh, I'm wondering where you got off to. Bell for a trap. Skill book. And we leveled up all in one. Thinking Magica Archery. I 
I need to find a mod that buffs uh, food healing. I don't want like HD food at all. It's just I want food to be able to have an effect, right? Because you run out of potions a lot. There's I find that it's hard to find them or craft them. It's I always run out of potions. So that's what I should get: a potion mod and a food mod. Probably mods for everything. All right, to Riverwood. You know, you should go to Windhelm and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here. Today. Hello. There you are. Ready? Finally. It was hard to find you. I have got a personal delivery for you. Just a moment. Here it is. An important letter directly from the Thalmor headquarters. Okay, that's all. Bye. If you on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. Did I see you talking to Sven? to do than listen to more of your fantasies. That is for the Ambriel quest. New to Riverwood? If you of course. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there's anything else you need, just let me know. Oh, what's this all about? What are you two doing here? A dragon? In Helgen? It can't be. Although, it would explain what I saw earlier. Flying down the valley from the south. I thought I must have just been seeing things. I don't know why, but I actually believe you. You've got the look of someone who's just seen a dragon. Things just go from bad to worse. First the war, now dragons. What's this world coming to? The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Uncle Rayla, can I see your axe? How many Imperials have you killed? Do you really know Ulfric Stormcold? Hush, Frota. This is no time for your feelings. All right, our house is here. Now let's loot the place. See what I can take without. Oh, she won't let me take that. Hmm, take that though. Oh, there's nobody here. I thought her husband was like just sitting here. Okay, so we gotta talk to the Jarl of Whiterun. Okay, and here we are. I actually, um, someone mentioned something a while ago about adding something to the outskirts of Whiterun, but I actually don't like doing that. I don't like to modify existing areas too much, just the textures of them. Clutters everything up and changes the vanilla look, which I do like. And uh, just, uh, I like stability. I don't like messing around things too much. Official business only. Fine, but we'll be keeping an eye on you. Me and my silver tongue. You guys ever have a different hub in this game besides White Run? Like set up in, I don't know, not Winterhold, but like Windhelm maybe. Solitude. Lately, it seems I am more nurse than priestess, tending to those who have suffered both in mind and body. Oh, I thought that was Isolde. Where is she? Uh, that's no, not around. I know your family's honor is important to you. Oh, you the power of Talos Storm Crown, born of the North, where my bread is born. Ain't nobody high and mighty in these halls, except in the North. Don't you forget, my lord. Please. Hello. 
Gonna bore your bet. She gotta disenchant a bunch of stuff. Boost this step. What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgraf is not receiving visitors. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then. The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Oh, it's uh Yeah. Dear left. Come to Dragon's it seems this you've got the aptitude. You should join the Mage's College in Winterhold. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? By Ismir, Irileth was right. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains, the Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done Whiterun a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps? Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and... Rumors of dragons. So and I don't want to fight. I want to just lay down. Father Brody. Father Brody. This kid yelling. Just spoiled baby. Another wanderer is here to lick my father's down. boots. Good job. Varengar. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. Go ahead and fill You know, if you've got the aptitude, you sh So the Jarl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Vault Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Okay. Remember, Priority. your mind is the best Anything weapon we you have. Fight this dragon or dragons. We need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Jarl Balgroof. You seem to have found me an able assistant. Did you say Groof or Poop? I might just be a servant among lords, but don't think for a moment I don't take my duties as seriously as... Man, I love those stars mod. It looks so cool. We're going to Pine Watch. It's right over here, but first, no, there's a evil necromancer. You know what? Give me your boots. I'll wear them. See, I told you he's evil. He's got a. Conjuration book. Conjuration isn't actually evil, but they do pull from oblivion, right? Where's... oh, there they are. This is like their lair, I guess.
Yeah, it's kind of a bummer about the original uh vanilla start there, but I can't remember the last time I've actually done that. I mean it's pretty long, like Bethesda has long intros. So I was just thinking about that. You know, Starfields is really long, like really long. Before you can actually go out on your own. It's weird, it's like empty. Into Pine Watch we go. I thought that was a coin pouch. Down the wine goes. How far can it go? Watch me like die from kicking it. Oh, there she is. Which will get disenchanted later, so that I can enchant my uh, custom armor. Yoink. Yeah, I don't know how you guys can play uh, vanilla UI for years. And I've talked to people in one of my groups that I'm on that has been playing vanilla for like 10 years. Or she's never downloaded a single mod. Oh my god, I couldn't do it. What was that? I mean, I guess though, if you don't know what's bad or if that's all you play and you've never seen modded, it wouldn't feel bad to you, maybe? Maybe that... Like, that's kind of the reasoning I was thinking. Yeah. Kind of like you don't know how it is until you've seen something else. Or seen someone else's game. I have a feeling I might be playing uh, a lot of Skyrim in November because I heard uh, Dragon Age is uh, very, very bad from early review or not early reviews, but early casters. But if it's not, it's all good. 
We'll keep playing Skyrim no matter what, I think. Okay, there's a guard right there, I think. Where is she? Oh, she's right there. Time to end this. Oh, it's usually a female. It's a uh, orc. Summit. I like that. Dark Souls Incorporation. this letter from Rois. Rois. I think my uh, quick light is kind of giving me away a lot. Oh, dark. Oh, see, it's so dark without it. I was thinking. Let's just put it on normal. See if that that's like. That's a little bit better. this one expert mm. I don't know about this one Yeah, they can't see me at all. I think it's, yeah, it was the torch. 100%. Makes sense though, right? That's like the pit boy laid on Fallout 4. I'll be a treasure room. Okay, this is a quest, I think. I thought I clicked the uh, trap trigger, but I guess not.
All right, so we got a treasure room key. What kind of treasure did she have, I wonder? Like that. Yeah, traps everywhere. That's one there. Oh, jeez. Ah, a little paranoid? Just a little. That's kind of crazy, like little paranoid there, Roris. Oh, what are we here? Is that a bandit? This will find out. Oh yeah. Looks like there's one more. she looks like she's right up there That's a nasty trap. Is there like a tension trigger for that? That I stepped on? Because I think it's like right here. There must have been pre a pressure plate. I don't see one though. I wonder if it's like motion. But there, there must be something there. One of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break in. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northwest of town. Oh, we're supposed to go there anyway. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Bleak Falls no, Barrow I, is just outside of town. I can show you. Fine, but only to the edge of town. All right, then. The sooner you... Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Mm. Oh, look how quick he is. Fine. Jeez, I'll come back later. I think it's a little bit wary of people like me, right? Well, guys, that's it for today. Next time we'll do Bleak Folds Barrow and all that encompasses it. All that comes with it, I mean. And, uh, yeah, we'll keep moving. Just a normal playthrough. So a little bit sad about the old room getting broken and stuff like that. But it is what it is, I guess. I have a perfectly good working Skyrim. Special edition. 
yeah, the OG was just kind of something I wanted to try out. And uh, yeah, just SE has so many features and so many improvements that it's just better to be on here anyway. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys next time.